Hello, I'm back. I'm gonna try a thing. One moment. There we go. Say hello to the world, Alphonse. What? What are you looking at? Yeah, he, he probably really doesn't want to deal with this right now. Come here. That's a boy. Come on. No? All right. He wants nothing to do with it. That's all right. Okay. And we'll click that button. And we'll, uh, I don't know about you, but I'm a huge fan of these freaking nerd chewy things. They're like the bomb. They're the bomb. I love them. I'm going to mute my mic while I chew on these. of Shandor. It's a pity that it was all used for evil. He would have just channeled some of it for good. The things he could have done. And now you know. As in, um, Alphonse from Full Metal Alchemist. Uh, his brother is Edward. Same letter. Uh, so we named him, because Ed originally was smaller than Alphonse, but then Ed got fat. <laughs> so it didn't work out, but we, we thought we named him after the Elric brothers. Oh yeah, there's people worshipping down there from Ivo, Mr. Ivo Shandor. Alright, come on, let's get some goose. So these goose you don't capture, you just spray them with goop. Surprisingly getting dead. Deader, I guess. And you're welcome. That's a that's a ghost fragment just kind of chilling there. Hey, you made it safe. I've brought you a cookie. Thank you. <laughs> Went through the flood to get this cookie, so. Yeah, I appreciate that. I will absolutely eat it. Thank you. I'm glad you're safe. <laughs> My wife brought me a cookie. Best day ever. Oh, everyone's getting hurt. Oh, okay. Because these things are here. Being in the way. Ow. Somebody please res me. So as long as one person is uh, alive, or not knocked down, uh, you're okay. Um, but if all of us get knocked out, it's just game over and you start over from the last checkpoint. Which is usually the, you know, the current battle you're working on. Oh. Where are you getting hit from? Oh, over here. So, let's see here. Is there another portal? I think we got all of them. Oh. Alright, they can fight those guys. I'm getting the artifact, dang it. Oh, a painting. Large painting. Let's see what it says here. Artifacts. Circa 1910, artist and Shandor devotee Vikram Vidam painted this fanciful scene after attending a prestig prestigious fox hunt on Timatat Island. Tiamat. 
Time mat. I can. I got this. That wasn't actually that interesting. Most of the artifacts actually have interesting info. Okay. We're gonna leave the black mess. Because <laughs> they're black slime. Yeah, exactly. That's it's very helpful. Even though they their AI isn't great, um, Unless my sensory array is malfunctioning, having them still function is, is huge. Jump kitty, kitty, kitty. Nope, hey, she's ignoring me. Go? Look at the size of this cookie. That Yo, Brittany got cool me. Breeze. Come on out. It's huge. It's Here, the size of my you. fist, like bigger. And of course I'm mute, so I don't say anything. Okay, you need to get to the other side to help you. Please be careful. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. But it sounds big. When big things attack, it hurts. Yep, that is correct, Ray. Oh good, that's right. Scary ghost ghost noises. That's the one thing about the black slime, which is really cool. Um, they, it just says stuff to you. You can barely understand it or hear it, so it's like, you know, a ghost whispering to you, which is pretty cool. Random Coke can down here. All right. I'm assuming Coke. So much black slime. Oh my gosh. No, you should not attack now, ghosts. You leave me alone. Leave me alone. Like leaving Brittany alone. Yes. Is that a rat? I don't know what that was. Oh, okay. Scary ghost thing. And it's gone. Oh, okay. Enemies. Let's get them dead. So yes, all the other Ghostbusters just got basically kidnapped. Or trapped by the ghosts. So now we're going to go rescue them by ourselves. Because we're clumsy and fell in a hole. But it worked out in our favor. Also, it helps move along the plot. The whispers seem like something that would drive you crazy, right? If you stayed here long enough, you'd just be like, nope. Can't tell if it's my own thoughts or the ghosts. Hey guys, whoa, all right. The one bad thing about this area um, is because you are by yourself, if you go down, you, you're just done. You have to start over and from that you know area again. So I have to focus and not get murdered. And now I'm gonna get murdered now that I said that. That's exactly what's gonna happen. Yeah. Oh, this area. That's right. Oh, that door's closing. Great! I hear something. Don't think it's supposed to do anything to me yet. Okay. Yes, 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 I know. Alright. Oh, that's right. So there's that hidden symbols on here. No idea what they mean, but there they are. Just gotta lower that a little bit. And of course it didn't go down all the way. Why would it? That one did. Come on. There it goes. Okay. Now. Now here's here is where the fun begins. Because I have to fight two of these. And little guys. I think. 
Or maybe it's just one of them, dude. I don't remember. Yeah, because those little things weren't bad enough by themselves. Oh, 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 oh. Gotta cool down. Keep spraying this dude. Oh, he's got chains. Why is he got chains? That's weird. Anyway. Oh. Hello, little slime fellas. You're not so tough. Gotta neutralize the portals. Oh, there's another black slime fella. That's not good. Come on. I can't aim. So let's do this. Cause he can't get to me unless until he comes down here, which is exactly what he's gonna do. That's the thing. That's a wall. Dang it. Ah. All right. All right, let's see where it starts me. I'm not, I'll probably have to defeat that other one again. Yep. All right. Here we, here I come to save the day. Cause that one starts in the middle of the floor, so that's something. Oh, cause I got caught in the wall. Yeah, what was really fun about this game back in the day, um, it had a multiplayer mode. So you actually, you could f you fight with other three other people, and you one of the waves was like a couple of these things at once. Um, so, <laughs> it was pretty cool. I really liked the multiplayer for this game. There was a Slimer Slam Dunk mode, so you'd have to catch a bunch of Slimers, uh, you and your, your team. And whoever got the most would win, uh, obviously. That's usually how those kinds of things go. Hey, friend. Um, but that was that was a fun game. Fun, more fun than Halo for me was this game online. And it was just real simple, just a bunch of waves, one after the other, nothing too crazy. Okay, I'm gonna have to worry about these things, aren't I? Hello, friend. Friends. Friends. Friends, friends, friends. Friends, friends, friends. Let's kill all these friends now. Alright. Hey, buddy. Don't. There's no need to run. Don't run in with scissors. We don't run inside. Don't run with chains. Got him. Got him! Now, it does help that I have all the upgrades. Uh, that certainly does not... Oh, black slime. That does not hurt my cause. Okay. If I remember, I have to go exploring. So, where do I go? What do I do? Oh, that's right. I go back the way I came, but under. Scary ghost whispers. I don't need any of that mess. Thank you very much. I'm just splaying the slime because I have a feeling there's something on the door. Oh, great. Ghost leading me on a trap. That, <laughs> that, that can't be good. What are you doing? Oh, hey, oh, 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 Come on. There we go. Easy peasy.
Yeah, watch my step is right. Oh. Looks like we got a couple other viewers, so welcome, guys. The one thing about the slime blower is you will cover yourself in slime with it. One of the ideas I've actually had for um, when I cosplay as Ghostbusters is I have one clean outfit, and what I'd like to do is make myself another outfit. Uh, but cover it in slime, like dried up and, and nasty. So like if I go to a Comic Con or something, and I'm in a position where I could get changed, I'd start with the clean one for like, you know, walk around for a little bit, and then go to the uh, room, get changed into the dirty one, and then people like, it'll kind of look like I got slimed or attacked by a ghost. Uh, and I thought that would just be an interesting thing. Also, how do you store your Ghostbusters? Thanks, man. I was seriously cramping up in there. May, what are you doing? All looking a little familiar. May. This okay, cat's just being weird. Slime came from. Look, they must have pumped it straight into the sewers from here. Let's go find Egon. Then we'll think about finding people. Yeah, look at all that slime. They're just making it here. They're just producing it. So what much slime. Is this place? Shandor's cult was working some crazy experiments in here. So Ghostbusters 2, that There's river of pink slime. slime. Pink slime, yellow this is slime. In, in the game, they explained it. This is where it came What's from. Generating it all? Where's it all coming from? Or at least it's implied. If they don't outright say it. Suddenly ghosts! Let's close these portals. Slash kill this one. Wow, down instantly, Winston? Yeah, mom's bringing something. Oh, wow. Okay, those things are very fast. Alright, well. You know, whatever. Yeah, exactly, Stone. Make some, um, <laughs> some crazy story. I was patrolling the back room and it just came out of nowhere. Hey, Rook. I'm trapped in a dark place. I can, can barely move my arms. Can you find me? I think you're getting closer to me. The sound. There we go. Hey. Ooh, thanks, man. It's like rewarding myself for losing e by e eating a cookie. All looking a little familiar. Ray would be giggling right now. This must be where all the mood slime came from. Look. They yeah, yeah, yeah I know, Winston. Let's go. Let's go. Stop and stop investigating. Let's go find Egon. Then we'll think about finding people. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Yeah. What is this place? It's your mom's basement. Andor's cult was working some crazy experiments in here. That's what it is. There's blue slime, pink slime, yellow slime, but every ghost in here is coated with black slime. What's generating it all? Where's it all coming from? Asking the important questions. Oh, I never heard that. I just heard a ghost whispers. They uh, they've seen too much. That's pretty cool, actually. Nope. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I gotta remember these guys. They are murderous. Oh, Winston. Great, great. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, running, 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 running. Get him up. Winston, you take care of that one. Oh, he's gonna please res me. Big 
Yes. All right, we'll close that portal. Uh, get up. So I think there is a limited number of those things, but if you can close all the portals first, it makes them harder to spawn. Come on. Let me get to it. It's not going to let me. That's fine. Ow. Oh, jeez, what was that? And revive. So it's like, if you clump, you both can get hit simultaneously by the same guy, which is bad. But if you miraculously don't get hit, you can just keep resing each other like one after the other. Oh, wow. Just sometimes you can't exactly tell where they're coming from. Crap. Crap, 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 crap. Come on, Winston. I'm down. I know. There you go. Look out above you. Behind Slime is not exactly the most accurate weapon to play. Is. Come on, buddy. Let's get you dead. I wonder if I've actually scanned one of these things yet. Okay, I, I did scan him. Good. Good, good, good. Aw, oh, come on, Winston. Letting the team down. Imagine if that's all people in hospitals had to do. Just like pick them up off the bed. You're cured! Roll number one. Don't get hit. Indeed. Look out, above you. Sorry, Winston. Just totally slimed you. Are you actually attacking something? Okay. So the other one, every time we go after him, he just disappears. Yep, there you go. Where are you? Probably over there. Run! He's gone. That one's dead. So where's the other? Where's the other friend? Where is he? Oh, out, I saw a slime. You. There he is. Come here, buddy. Oh, Stay still, so I can dead you again. Be re dead. Zelda zombies. Oh my gosh. Stop running. Where'd he Behind go? You. Behind me? He's not, though. He's in front of me. Look out. There we go. Shows well on your I think you're really turning some heads back at headquarters. Man, what are these spooks up to? I get the whole Mandela immortality and power thing. But what's up with all the stuff inside? What makes me laugh? Ah, um, we actually two days ago we recorded our episodes for next week. We're playing Star yeah, Wars again. Yes, that's uh, You're close. And it's it's choppy. It, the we think that the Fallen Order was optimized for the Xbox One S and Xbox One X, uh, and not. For uh, the original Xbox, which we play on, uh, this game is running smoother on a Switch. I'm actually using a Switch Pro controller um, than the freaking Star Wars does, which is insane to me. Granted, it's a re it's a remaster of a ten year old game, but still. Alright, look, look close to me. Oh! Alright, I can just get hit by two things and dead. Get down. Immediately. They realize that would happen. Then again, it is hard mode. So, where's the shock exactly? 
now that we have two more Ghostbusters, the game is just going to throw more at us. And there will be one of those towering slime monsters too, eventually. Oh my gosh. That makes sense. I'm debating. Um, oh, here's a big boy. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Surprise at least one of these guys. Oh snap! Egon, please. Oh yeah, come down here and say that. I, I'm right next to you. Oh boy, this is not gonna go well. I have a bad feeling. Yep, there it is. Cookie time. No, I don't want to quit. Help me. Um, what I want to do for X-Wing Squadrons. Because I'm going to end up getting that same graphics card for myself. Because my graphics card is 12 years old. Something like that. So, I'll have an updated graphics card. And it'll probably look better than my Xbox One. Get so, I'm thinking I will uh, get X-Wing Squadrons for my PC and do it that way. But, I'm not 100% sure yet. I'm just going to try to close these portals first. Oh, I never got him out. Whoops. So now we're going to fight through these guys. Oh, jeez. No, no, no. <laughs> no. This isn't going to go well. Mm -mm. Oh, I got smacked. I got smack dab. Smack, smack it, smack it. Smack a lack it. Come on. Egon, let's get you out. All right, so now I gotta hope that these two bums get me up. Yes, get me, get me, get me, get me, get me, get me. Yes. All right. So actually, doing it in the wrong order may have been the right decision. <laughs> That's the problem. You res everybody, and then the things that are there will attack you. you got a mean street, Let's close some portals, shall we? Oh, they're already closed. Hear him. I'm down. Yeah, 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 we know. There, now get up. Oh, he's stuck behind the thing. And part of the problem is that you're standing in black slime, so they're getting hurt. There we go. Let's see if I can just sneak around the back here. There we go. This machinery indicates an astounding level of sophistication. Pure evil notwithstanding, Evo Shandor was far ahead of his time. You know I have to take my hat off to Shandor? This lab was built how many years ago? 
It's truly impressive. It's likely Shandor was the parapsychology expert of his time. Stay in the light, Egon. <laughs> trying, Winston. Should we try to find Peter or probably stash him around here somewhere? Okay, something is angry. Help! Yo, little help! I think I hear. Come on, Did boys. Call a break? Yep, that's Binkman, all right. Now, we're sure about this, right? We need to be at full strength to shut down this node. Way to go! I feel a momentum swing here in our favor. Get out there and find the Mandela node and shut it down. That should really piss someone off. Hey, I got places to go people will need. Can we move out of here? Great job, kid. Glad to hear Peter's okay. What are they doing? The readings are as big as those at the library when we crossed over. I think it's safe to assume that the machine they're working on was not built for a benign purpose. It's an orrery, a device typically used for predicting planetary alignment. In this case, it appears to actually be aligning dimensions. I, for one, do not want the dimensions to align. Not this close to Christmas. That would put a damper on the holiday. How do we shut that thing down? The motion of those devices seems to be generating some sort of energy. Hard to tell, though. What if you get it? You did it. How come people smart enough to use science always try to take over the universe? Huh? Egon, great. Anyone? Didn't think so. All right, so you know how we've been fighting um, little uh, slime, black slime monsters. Yeah. I think we found the source of the black slime, Winston. I wasn't that curious. Yeah. Just assume whatever your assumption on is of the boss, which we're about to fight. Yeah. Now we got for the room to fill up with black slime. It's getting there. Look, black slime. Oh no. Oh, now the stairs are cut off. Hooray. What could possibly go wrong? Smells like the Fulton fish market when they've got fish. Wait, I know that dumpster. The putrid mass of hatred, bile, and anger. Not exactly Mrs. Sunshine, is it? Yep, that's a giant this is blob. The part where we do what we do. Love that. Juvenile Slar. He's gonna blow up his eyeballs. We've got to cut off his visine. Somebody chop some onions. Giving me the evil eye, huh? So many bad puns. Yep, he's happy. He's a happy boy. So I gotta basically lure this thing into attacking me like that and then they help res me and then I gotta shoot their head and it doesn't like it when I do that. Go. Took a little too long there, Winston. Oh, all right. That time it didn't kill me. What? <laughs> this thing looks 
completely reasonable to me. Oh, I'm in black slime. Crap, that means Venkman's gonna go down in a second. Alright. Come on. Come on, big cat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll help you up. There it is. And it's dead. All the nodes are closed. The ghosts are trapped in the now. Right where they belong. Our boy Evo Shandor didn't factor in that he was messing with the Ghostbusters. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's a weird plumbing situation. Don't forget that Peter's girlfriend is a Shandor. Very long time ago. You guys need to get down to the shore and fast. I don't know how much longer I can hold her. The whole island's sinking. Ray, keep the motor running. We are coming at you fast. Cutscene. Peter, get out of there. How was it? Was it cool? What did it look like? Did you get any samples? Did it have multiple eyes? Shut up. <laughs> Thank God you're here. What's going on, Janine? Where's Alyssa? She's gone. They took her. One minute everything was fine, the next it was chaos. Ghosts flying everywhere. Janine, slow down. Start from the beginning. Okay. Well, I was a little late this morning because one of the heels on my favorite pair of pumps broke, and Lester's was out of my favorite tea. You know how I love my chamomile. Well, and... Okay. Maybe not the beginning. Start where things went haywire around here. Okay. Okay. Somebody jumped me from behind. <laughs> every thing I, I know down, at some point does that bit, and, yelling, and it's no! funny every time. Thing I remember was this at least the first time, and then in my brain. no. So this is when you rewatch it, it's not as funny. <laughs> or someone shut down our containment grid again, again, just like Peck threatened to do. It's funny. I always knew that Peck was a pencil neck bureaucratic prick. But I never pegged him as an evil occultist. So yeah, right now we think uh, Walter Peck is um, all the ghosts? messing oh, with the ghosts. No offense, but if all the ghosts we've ever caught just escaped, and doing the whole Evo Shandor mandala yeah, thing, yeah, they would be awfully mad at us. Exactly. It's generally a bad idea for the guards to hang out in the cell blocks just after a prison break. This just in. As authorities continue to supervise the Thanksgiving evacuation of Manhattan, increasingly powerful tremors are rocking Central Park. The <laughs> question is, where are the Ghostbusters? Uh, tell you what, it's kind of a nice day. Why don't we go to Central Park? Could run up some ghosts. Save the girl. Yeah, no, that's not the finale, boss. Um, we are okay. very close. Um, we're actually at the last section of the game. Um, this next part is the last one. Uh, there is a part that I will probably die 15 to 30 times, especially in hard mode. Um, it's the worst part of the game. It's absurdly difficult. Um, and just poorly, it's a, it's a poor section. Um, so, you know, there's that. Where's the fun in that? Yeah, right. As <laughs> if if you like the humor of the, the first Ghostbusters movie, they do a very good job of capturing that in this one. Um, and I believe actually Harold Ramis and Dan Aykroyd wrote the story for this game. Um, so yeah, it makes sense. going to need the super slammer up there no telling how powerful peck has grown that means we gotta take the ecto one i'll drive maybe the trainee should drive nah thanks winston what's your thing stone of, uh, of the movies especially after like 35 years or whatever it's been right i don't like the second one as much but the first one i Definitely a huge fan. My ah, wife hates him, but that's all right. Even with that hundred pounds of proton accelerator. Ow! That was 
That was ow there. Make your way I should make a gate in front of my house with those faces on it. Keep out people from trying to sell me stuff. So it's like, yeah, here's, here's where I'm starting. I need to get to here. So you figured I could just jump over it. But you can't. I have to go now on this long journey. Wow. Look at the storm system building above that tower. Yeah, isn't that good? Time we saw that kind of atmospheric disturbance. That's right. At Dana Barrett's building, the night she turned into a dog. I missed it broken entryway. So yeah, now basically we gotta fight our way through ca catacombs uh, that are somewhere just in Central Park in New York. They are just underneath. Which is kind of really cool actually. <laughs> That ghost was running this way. Let's get our slime blower th up again. Oh, good, a church. That's a good sign. Ghost church. I keep pressing the wrong button. <laughs> I like the way they're funny because the characters being themselves on like all the film movie which is trying to be funny for the sake of be funny. You're right. It was. Um, I still enjoy that one because I, I, it's ghosts and proton packs. It's like, I guess it's kind of like the equivalent of people with The Last Jedi. I liked it because it had X-Wings and lightsabers. I mean, that's all I wanted. Um, but... <laughs> So, I'm, like I said multiple times, I'm very easy to please. Um, where am I going exactly? Probably over here. Whoa, ghost skulls. Cool. Flying skull. Class one something something something. Oh, it just locked me in here, didn't it? Yep. Cool. That's great. I love it. He said lying. Yeah, I know I shouldn't be here, ghosts. Just leave me alone, I'll leave you alone. Yeah, probably. Oh, that's Mr. Bones. Oh, oh, and another one. Just falling from the ceiling. That's great. Always a good time when skeletons just rain from on from from on high. I can speak. I can speak the English so good. Speed it up there, tiger. You yeah, speed it up there. Buddy. Thanks for the light, buddy. <laughs> Here I come to save the day. I think I made it. I made it. Boss, you all right? How's that gate coming? It's coming great. Hold your horses. Oh, come on, really? There we go.
God, I love that car. So cool. Remember how there wasn't a break in the gate before? Now there is, suddenly. And Ray comes to help. I mean, he's my favorite Ghostbuster, so I'm cool with finally having a level, just me and him hanging out. That's fun. Let's explore the cemetery. Evil laughter? I mean, nothing wrong with that. Oh, hey. Not very happy about us being here. Yeah, probably not. Can't imagine why that would be. Am I supposed to go over here? I don't even know. Let's try. Why is the game frozen? Oh, okay. It's just... Man. A Star Wars game. Hey, zombies. You saw them too, didn't you? They think they're sneaky. Let's spread out and flank them. getting murdered there we go catch this catch this ghost leave me alone little stone man dang it come on Ray that's a guy I would love to so I guess uh, while I'm fighting these guys, um, if you look at my pack, so there's that little spinny health uh, thing. Actually, that's not what that is. There's two um, parallel bars that are horizontal. Oh wow, we both got killed. Reload. Oh, uh, that's my health. So the it starts green, and then as it gets to red, it'll um, that's me. My, that's basically my health. As well as the red around the screen. Um, then there's two bars that fill vertically. Actually, now I can do it in the camera. Um, that are next to them. That's actually the pack heat level. Um, and I have to press the right trigger to do that. So right now you don't see it. You see my health. But now you see my pack overheating. As it slowly goes up. Then I got the PKE meter on my hip. So when I press that, that's... That's this thing. It tells me if there's ghosts around. Uh, so that'll go red when there's enemies nearby. Where do I go? Oh, do I have to? I do. Come on. Let me put you. Here. There we go. Yeah, um, I agree with that, Stone. So I was just reading your thing. Um, uh, if you have Disney Plus, I'd recommend watching the Skywalker, Rise of Skywalker. Um, it's one of those things that I'm not. I agree. There is some character development. Poe had the most character development out of all the characters, um, and I think Finn did as well. Ray, not as much. Um, I think they could have flushed out her character more but I'm actually curious to see if someone who was an orphan or who was adopted has a different take on Rey because maybe they um, relate to that character more and I'm not sure uh, but again I'm just along for the ride I don't care there were spaceships and lightsabers <laughs> very very easy to please and yeah the comics are really interesting for, for Kylo Ren I think they could have fleshed him out better too
You saw them too, didn't you? They think yeah, sneaky. exactly. They they did a Let's great design with the pack. Um, because it's just more practical. And like, the, the, there is nothing on the screen. I mean, with the exception of me changing what weapon types I'm using, is really nothing. It, Ray just destroyed that zombie. Oh, I wonder if there's a spawn over there. It is. Let me close these portals. Jump out of the way. And you don't even necessarily have to look at it, uh, the pack, because you can kind of just get a feel for it as often as you shoot it, like when it when it's gonna overheat. Um, and the controller will vibrate too. Like it'll start to get really crazy. So it kind of gives you some feel. Like I imagine you would just kind of feel it if you were actually wearing this proton pack. And I love just the simple design of, let me change it to my slime blower. And the, uh, the thing pops up and all the uh, dials on the back of the pack are now green. Or like they go orange if I use the Mazon Collider. And if I use the Shoddy, it goes blue. It's, it's just really cool. I love the design. It's just really, it's a simple, elegant solution. And I don't run away from a fight in a video game. If it's in real life, yes, I'd run so fast so fast yeah. uh -oh. he's fine nope nope he exploded Ray don't go too far out there so I'm not gonna be able to heal you What are you getting attacked by? Oh, flying skulls. Great. Everybody's favorite. Ow, that hit me too. Where are they coming from? There's one. Alright. No, oh, yeah, that's right. You can set... Because it's an old cemetery and... You know, it just is what it is. There's a lot of stuff you can just set on fire. Nothing's being watered here. Not for centuries. Ah, wow, I am getting hurt. We stay near Ray because I have a feeling he's gonna either get me up, then I'm gonna have to get him up. Oh yeah! Oh Ray, no! All right. Yeah, let's get you up. I'm on your team. Oh, okay. Let's go skulls. I don't know where these skulls are coming from. Ah, uh, okay. It might be coming from here. Jump out of the way! Come on, ghost. Let's go. Let's dance. Let's, let's DDR. Stand clear. Stand clear. Come on. Oh, there's four flying skulls. Look behind you. Oh, oh, there he goes. Yes. All right. Oh, 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 too much. There we go. Got him. Above you. Just kind of assumed that would be the end of it. Oh, there's a fat boy over there. That's what's throwing the skulls, is this guy. Come. 
Yeah, flying skulls, they're just... No, no one has any problem with that. Ray, what are you shooting at me for? If I just hit it with one boson dart, there I go. Got him. All right. Mission, mission success. Oh, do it. Dude, doing some Halo armor, ODST or otherwise, would be really cool uh, as a project. That's something I would recommend. Um, Warbla? 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 Oh. Um, basically, there's there's foam you can get that you can heat up and mold. Um, I've considered making my own Stormtrooper armor with it. Uh, it is expensive, though. Or it can be. Oh, alright. That's, that's cool. Let's go. Uh, so that's something to keep in mind. And it's something that you can get a couple sheets of it. Um, use a heat gun to heat it up and it's mold. So you can like work on the shoulder piece or the chest piece. So, like you can do it in bits so that, you know, slowly over time you have it finished. Oh, that's right. Okay. I gotta. Mr. Ghost is taking this happy skull away or head. Yeah, that's a that's a happy head. Anyway. Whoa! Don't remember him being there. Easy there, Bulldog. Give the rest of us a chance. No. You've had years to practice this, Ray. I'm just a newbie. Look behind you. Solid vaporization. Solid, kid. All right, here we go. Happy to tell yourself. Get it back to the gate so we can keep going. Really? Come on. Why is this stuck? That was weird. Come on. Ray, why are you making so much noise? I just, I got nothing. <laughs> That's what I look like if I don't get a shower after a day or two. Oh, okay. Let's just shoot hot coals at me. Does that make sense? Whoa! Phew! Alright. Should be dead. Why is he not dead? I am backing myself into a corner. Great. Raise down. And he's dead. All right. Where's Ray? Come here, buddy. There we go. A little, I guess what you would consider a mini boss done. Necromantic shockwave summoned Gozer back to our planet. On the first Why episode, didn't he assume a more effective destructor form immediately. I mean, the Marshmallow Man is scary, sure, but there has to be a better way to destroy the world. It's simple. When he enters our plane of existence, he must be locked into that form from our first encounter. One destructor form per god per dimension. I like it. Sounds like the kind of symmetry these things tend to operate on. Hey, so maybe I didn't choose such a bad destructor after all, huh? <laughs> <laughs> 